FreeBSD. Is this operating system usable as a daily OS? No, it really isn't, because it is not designed to be used as such, but many people, myself included, like to try out other operating systems, and FreeBSD is a lesser known operating system overall, but this makes it an interesting one to look at, and since it does not feature a GUI, it is very hard to use, because if you want a graphical desktop, you must install it onto FreeBSD. The process for this is quite involved, and takes some time, because I have been there and done that before. But at the end of it, you get a more usable operating system, which also means you can use stuff like Audacity, GIMP, LibreOffice, and other such software on FreeBSD. The well-established free and open source software supports FreeBSD, but overall, there is a lot less software available on FreeBSD or any BSD for that matter. FreeBSD also has less hardware support than most Linux distros, so this makes it somewhat more difficult to install on physical hardware, however, FreeBSD is perfect for servers, embedded devices, workstations, and system on a chip type computers, but BSD could also work on any regular desktop or laptop, you would just have to do some fiddling around depending on how well it works with your existing hardware. FreeBSD is an amazing operating system, but for my liking, it is more usable as a learning environment than it is an actual operating system on a desktop or laptop, simply because it is very complex to set up and configure, and the fact that you don't get a graphical user interface is also a downside, but that's only because I am used to using a GUI. Some people out there may have better knowledge on how to use a command line interface, which is what Linux and BSD operating systems generally have, the latter being the one to feature a command line for all variants, in contrast, Linux distributions have a user-friendly GUI, whilst BSD, except OpenBSD, feature a basic command line, or bash console interface, which is daunting for a lot of people. But if you know the commands necessary, using BSD is actually quite fun, because you learn how it works, and you become familiar with certain commands, but for the average Joe, I don't think FreeBSD is your best replacement for Microsoft Windows, you're better off trying one of the many hundreds of Linux distros, or buying a Mac, if you got that kind of money.